We'll be getting started between the 1 minute mark and 1 minute 30 second mark on the top left of the elapsed time screen right there. So everybody get yourself settled in and we'll be getting started real soon. Till then I'm going to have a little bit of my Coca-Cola because, you know, it's the closest thing to Nuka-Cola. So cheers to you. Yes, sir. This is going to be an interesting little stream we're going to do here. Mm. Got my shoulder. Mm. Okay, there we go. My shoulders are still a little bit tense, but it's all good. Thank you for the host, Prideful Entertainment, also known as the amazing Iron Hobbit. And it is now the 1 minute 30 second mark, so hello internet, and welcome back to Fallout 4, The Adventures of Isaac Eastwood. I am your friendly neighborhood game machine, Onyx, and today we're going to be continuing our western style today. With Isaac Eastwood, our man that only uses pistols and things that replicate dynamite. Because <laughs> why not? So, here is Isaac Eastwood, looking amazing as always. And he's getting close to going up a level. So, that's what we're going to do. We're going to get him up a level... And there's our dude Sheffield right there because we got ourselves to Diamond City last stream. Where, where'd you go? Where'd you go? There's Sheffield. There's our dude right there. Yeah. Yeah. I'm trying to think. Did I Did I already assign him his bed? I think I did. Yeah, I think I assigned him his bed already. So that's that's pretty good. That's pretty good indeed. Okay, so let me think. We're gonna I guess well for one, I need to go ahead and go up a level. Because I have a small little speck left of uh, experience I need to go up a level. So, you know, I guess, why not? Does Sheffield have a chair? You know, we're going to give Sheffield a chair. You know, Sheffield should have something nice to sit on. You know, we're, we're going to give him a nice little fancy chair. We'll give him this nice little chair right here. You know, we'll put it in the corner right here. And then, we went up our level. All right, so let us go up our level. Leveled. Yes. Okay, so let's see how I'm going to do this here. So that means I'm at level 6, so I can't put that up to level 7, which that is something I do need to do. Uh, but let me see. I'm going by my perks here. Uh, hmm. Let's think here for a minute. We'll get those up in a later time. I need to boost up my sharpshooting skills before I even decide to go into my criticals. So let's see. Another weakness. You can view a target specific damage resistance in bats. I can save that for later. Um, let's see now. Hmm. Yeah, that could probably be very useful. Make sure my action points regenerate 25% faster. That actually might be very useful. Let me check my headset real quick. Things seem kind of low. No, my headset's at max. Okay. There's Dixie. Alrighty. Excuse me, uh, dog meat. 
Scoob. Alright, so we got Dixie, we got Fistful, and we got GBU. Diddy, diddy, whoop, whoop. Yo, this is your host, B. Dizzle on the Hizzle, Shizzle, my Grizzle, Dizzle. Ah, uh, Green Orb Wizard, great to see you again, man. How you doing? Thank you for the five bits. Oh, yeah. So we got, as our weapons for now, we got Dixie, we got Fistful, and we got GBU. GBU being good, bad, and the ugly. Fistful, which is the fistful of dollars. Dixie because of Mr. Rumble Roses. Um, you know, I, I, I like doing nice stuff for Mr. Rumble Roses. Um, let's see. I don't think we're the right level to go and help out, um, Nick. So, let's see how we're going to do this. Well, for one, you know, that's a really nice moon right there. Um, let's get some sleep here. You know, let's, let's do that. It's 8.20 p.m. Let's do this when it's during the day. So let's uh, do 10 hours. Let's do 10 hours right there. It should be close to daylight when we wake up. Keyword, close to daylight. So let's see. Yeah, it's getting close. And it's raining. It's raining, it's pouring, the old man is snoring. And hello, Mr. Rumble Roses. Thank you for the five-bit cheer. How are you doing today, sir? Are you doing good, Rumble? Are you having a fantastic time? There's nothing here, though. I think I know one good little place that I should uh, raid and get some kills from. Did somebody call my name? I don't know. Did somebody call your name, Rumble? I'm just joking. Yeah. Buying GTA 5 for Steam now. Awesome. Yeah, GTA 5 is not a bad game. Yeah, it's not too bad. Well, oh, it's under 20 bucks. Yeah, that might be something nice to capitalize on. Let's put our flashlight out here. Let's see. Oh, dog meat. It's right over here, yes. All right, dog meat. Let's go take out some shit. There's going to be some mire lurks down here. We need to make sure they die. We got to kill some crabs. All right, dog meat, let's go. We got to be careful, you know. We got to be careful, don't you know? Because there's some, uh, there's some crabs down here. And as much as I love eating crab, these are some very evil crabs, though. Let's kind of see how much damage I could do to one of these motherfuckers. Let's see. Uh... That'll be one interesting little kill shot. Let's see. Hmm. We'll shoot the hell out of it when it gets over here. There we go. Down for the count, Boyle. Give me some of that meat. Thank you. Okay. And for one, my ear is acting up again. You're doing some Z bloody hell and ultimate custom night. Wait, ultimate custom night. You're doing more FNAF stuff still? I got, I got, I got, I got, I got, I got. Hey, me SpongeBob. Hey. Let's see. Ah, oh, you got some sugar bombs over here. There we go. Where there's a will, there's a way. 
You must have really liked those sugar bombs, huh? Hey, dog meat. Brad Roach. Really? Uh, I'll be able to get the hit now. Wah, wah, wah. I should be able to hit that. Oh, we got a glitch out, ladies and gentlemen. We got ourselves a glitch out. It's dead now. No, he's not dead. No. Oh, gotcha. Hmm. I'll take the meat, though. I'll take the meat. Ow, oh, shoot. I don't know why my ear's acting up there. Move, dog meat. Well, you move, dog. Thank you. Okay, nothing there. Nothing here. Or here either. Nothing. Okay. Got an end of dungeon steamer trunk. I'll take that stuff at least. Got some mintats. Got that there. What we got in here? 45 rounds, some wander glue. Got some canned dog food. Got some cram. Got some yum yums. All right. We got some mintats and guano on sticking to Nuka Cola. Yeah. That'll be fun. Get out of the way, dog meat. Man. Okay. Ah, yeah. There's no problem with that. I mean, it's not... I don't dislike FNAF, of, co of course. You, I mean, you know that. You know, but... My times of FNAF are over. You know, I... I ended it when it came to the last game. And I played it both in a pacifist-type way and then in a genocide-type way. You know, I played it as a, uh... How the hell do I get over there? I played it as both a simulator and then as a FNAF game. Thought so. Get out, boy. Got it. Anybody else? Okay. I'll take the meat, though. I'll probably take the hide, too, because that counts as uh, leather. Yeah. I figured as much. Alright, dog meat. Let's see what we can do here. That can't be all of them, though. Hmm. Adjustable wrench. But I will say, though, that, uh... My old FNAF playthroughs, I do have them on Twitch. I might actually replay those um, this month. Because there's going to be at least one week at the end of the month uh, where I am going to uh, take a sabbatical from Twitch because it's my birthday month. Um, I, of course, people probably understand, of course, you know, 
But uh, no matter if I have plans or not, I do want at least like some type of uh, I guess say break from Twitch. Um, it from this end. You know, on my birthday month, even if I don't have anything planned, I don't know. I mean, no one's come forward to see if they want to make any plans on my birthday, so, you know, we'll see. But, uh, one of the things I did have planned is, um, I guess I could call them my, uh, my happy birthday reruns, I guess. I don't know. Yes. Um, I'd probably call it that. Um, I'll still work with the name where I'll do uh, um, I'll do reruns of like specific things that I liked playing things of that nature ooh a quantum I'll take the lunchbox too I'll take that as well and of course people probably understand you know ooh okay I'll take that oh excuse me sorry about that guys let me see. That seems to be everything, I guess. Can't go through there, so we'll have to go back down here. Okay. But yeah, um, I'll probably consider it a request um, if you want me to replay my FNAFs, even if there are no commentary. I did work really hard on them. I think that's where I need to go. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, thank you for the clip, Mr. Rumble Roses. It's always a blessing to have you make a clip for me. Oh! Okay, now I know. Okay. Haven't been down here for a while. A little bit lower. Ah, okay. I was close. Got it. Sometimes I do some locks uh, slowly. Depends on um, my first attempt. That's not good. Alright, dog meat. I think we're done here. Go do some more exploring outside of the sewers. Because sewers are usually very bad. You know. Let's see if there's... Okay, there's just up water there. No, there's nothing else here. Okay. I mean, at least outside of, like, small supplies. But, I don't know. But yeah, I, like I was saying, though, I'll probably consider it a request from you, Mr. Rumble Roses, um, to replay all of my FNAF stuff that I've done. Uh, from FNAF 1 all the way to uh, FNAF Simulator. Um, but I'll leave it up to you, Rumble. Is um, Because I did two specific different runs of, um, you know, the Pizzeria Simulator. Do you want me to do the one where I um, play it like a FNAF game, or do you want me to play? Or do you want me to show the one where it's just nothing but me pretending like I'm making a pizzeria? Dog, I mean, I think you're losing your fucking mind. Um, I'll let you pick, Marble. I'll let you pick. I should check to see if there's anything down here. Do you know, I know there is, but you know, we'll do a quick save just in case. All right, let's go. Ah, uh, civic access. Wait, is this where the chain door is? Could be. Still gotta be careful though, nonetheless. 
Yes. This is the ch where the chain door was. Very nice. We'll close that up. Okay. Bones. Lots of bones. Okay, that's already dead. Oh, gotcha. All right, I know where I am. Uh, dead Brahmin. Well, now. A duffel bag, okay. I won't take the pipe revolver. It's not. It's not anything useful. Okay. All right. So apparently somebody was here at one point. Dog meat. Don't do that shit. Sometimes I wish that dog could not open doors. Because sometimes that does kind of startle me. At least he thinks something's going to come in. Oh. By the way, Rumble, you do know that I asked you a question, right? I asked you twice, actually. What's in here? Workhouse. We'll look into the workhouse. Probably see if we can clear out a little bit of Concord here. Hmm. Oh, I know this spot. I know this spot. Nah, I won't clear this out. There's really nothing here. I can handle that. Alrighty then. Well, I guess one place we could clear out could be uh, um, Starlight Drive-In. Okay, I'll, I'll ask one more time, homie. Um, because I'll be taking at least the last week off in July because of my birthday month, I... Uh, I wanted to see, um, for one, um, if you wanted me to replay as a rerun for my happy birthday reruns or whatever, uh, my whole FNAF playthroughs I've done. And if so, because of the last FNAF game, and I played it two different ways, I did it both at playing it as a FNAF game, where I brought all the animatronics together and did the main ending, and I did a playthrough where I treated it like a pizzeria simulator, I wanted to see if you wanted to choose between those two. Do you want me to only play the one where I treat it as a FNAF game? Or do you want me to only play the one where I treat it as a pizzeria? I'll let you choose. Because you have been a very faithful mod to me and everything, I was thinking, you know, I'll let you choose um, the final uh, upload for... Um, my FNAF rerun. If that makes any sense. Well, are you gonna do it or not? Don't come any closer, friend. This doesn't concern you. Please, help! They're going to kill me! Shut up! Hmm. Okay. Sure, we can work this out. No one has to die. Fat chance. This synth has been watching us for weeks. Knows everything about us. We let this thing go. How long before it comes back with its institute buddies to put us down? Why the hell would we risk that? Uh, 
I like that what he's doing with his eyes right there. I like that. Um, hasn't hurt you yet. You need to let him go. Think about it. If he meant to hurt you, FNAF 6 Pizzeria all Simulator, all sir. Just his time. I don't know, and I don't care. But this thing is not walking away from him. Ah, uh, let's get out of this. We'll let them have their fun. Has nothing to do with me. Especially with this character. And plus, you know I haven't done the um, ultimate uh, custom night, and I don't plan to. We'll leave that up to Marky Moo if he wants to play that or not. That's out of my jurisdiction now. I've already proven my worth with FNAF. I don't have to prove anything any further. Oh, that spot. Nah, I'm not ready to go there yet. We're going to take a nice little stroll. You're missing my point that I asked you, Rumble. But don't worry about it. I'll just do it myself. I'll fix up the reruns the way I want to then. But no, I'm not going to do the ultimate custom night. It does not interest me. I believe there is some ghouls over here. Or did I kill them all already? Was this a playthrough where I killed them all? Maybe. I don't know. Okay. I'll, I'll say it one more time, Rumble. Listen carefully. I'm taking the last week off in July because of my birthday month, okay? I'm setting up some reruns. One of my reruns is going to be all the FNAF games I've played, okay? Now, the last FNAF game, because it was a pizzeria simulator... All right, I played it two different ways. I played it as a FNAF game, and then I played it also as a pizzeria simulator. I was going to let you choose which of those two playthroughs should I put in the rerun. I don't want to put both in there because it's the same game technically. There you go. Let's see. Let's go through here and kill whatever we find. Oh, you're dead. No, oh, damn. Hello, MK Vibe. Welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? Well, I guess as a game and not a simulator. Okay. Got you. <laughs> Good to know, man. Good to know. What you been up to lately, MK Vibe? Do a quick save. Never know what you'll find in this game. That's why I gotta be careful. <sighs> Fix myself up here. Hmm. Do it. 
sealed up since the Great War? There's no telling what might be inside. I know what that is. And I know for a fact if I am to go anywhere near it or anything, it'll probably explode. And those are dogs. Those are big, mean dogs. Hmm. All right, Hobbit, you have yourself a great night, man. It's hmm. one down. I thought there was two. Hmm. Okay. I want to see if this thing will still explode. I really think this thing will explode. Yep, it explodes. I thought so. I've always wondered what's down that hatch, though. <laughs> That's why I quick saved before I did it. Damn, that was one hell of a fucking thing. Whew. I wish there was a way that I could, you know, do that without it exploding, though. Let's see. I always wondered what was in there, but you probably will never know. I never found a way to um, detonate it without it exploding. That's a real big explosion. Nothing there. Well, it's like I can fast travel anytime I want to. I don't want to yet. I'm exploring. Is this where that power armor is? Yes. It's that random suit of power armor. Hmm. <laughs> Interesting. Open the door. Nothing. Okay. Believe there's uh some mongrels up here. Don't quote me though. Could be. Yeah, I mean, thought so. It's the only one that's appearing, though. Where's your friends? There's a mole rat, too. Come on up here, doggo. Stag dough. And then a mole rat. Critical strike. Yep, that th yep, that thing's pissed off. Come 
One's down. Oh yeah, I get you. I get you, homie. I get you. I also should be careful. There might be a bear around here. I believe around this area there is a bear. I just don't know where exactly. And it'd be pretty bad if I tried to fight a bear. I'm not the right level at all to fight a freaking bear. And of course I'm back here. I'm not going for that ragstag, man. Let's go this way, dog meat. And hope we don't run into anything as big as a bear or a death claw. Just in case. Quick save. Rats. There's nobody here. Oh, God. Ooh, fucker. Oh god. Ooh, bitch. Oh, bitch. Oh, bitch. Oh, bitch. I need to move. I need to move. I need to move. Oh my god, that startled the crap out of me. Ooh, my god. I, I should have thought why there was radiation. And yet, no barrels. Ooh, that scared the fucking crap out of me. Oh. God damn. I'm going to blame Rumble. Everything's better when you blame Rumble. I blame I blame Rumble for that uh for this rad scorpion. Go for that tail. As much as I can. Oh. That thing can kill me fast. Oh, I don't know how the fuck I survived that, man. But I did. I'm not even the right fucking level. Wait. Is there another one? Oh, no. I don't like this. I don't like this. We're going to go this way. I'm not fighting another one of those. Fuck that. I still blame you, Rumble. Ah, <laughs> oh. Rad Scorpions. Yes, I summoned it to scare you to death. To possibly make a clip. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> From the words of uh, Gordon Ramsay. Fuck off! It's fucking raw! It's, I don't know. Oh, god damn. For one, I don't know how the fuck I survived that. Especially even on normal. Because rad scorpions are some tough fuckers. Mm. Man. I'll tell you what, though. 
survival mode. Red scorpions are no fucking joke, man. They are no fucking joke. Neither are blood bugs, and neither are death claws. Or uh, bears. Oh god, the bears. Good for you, dog me. Why don't you go fetch it like a good dog? We're gonna clear out the supermarket. I'm going to clear out the super duper mart now. I believe it's time. It's time for us to kill some ghouls. Do I even have enough? Oh god, yeah, I got I got way more than enough. Um All right. I want to see if I had enough uh room to get all this stuff. But it's now time to do some killing. And I know just the right gun to do it with. We'll put Dixie away for now. We're going to... Well, let me see. I was thinking about GBU, but I remember I don't have enough bullets for GBU yet. But, uh, let's see... 26 and 36. I guess we could use Fistful for a little bit. Alright. We'll use Fistful for a little bit. Will you get out of the way, dog meat? Please. Quantums. Don't mind if I do. Well. That head, though. That head, though. Nuka Cherry. And a dead body. Got all this Nuka. Got all this Nuka. That's an empty bottle. careful air horn dot wave what sounds very stakes okay move that out of my way Let's open this. I know there's some behind here. Just this way. I'm close. Got it. That's it. Aha. Thought so. Simon. I love the sound it makes. Oh, that's bullshit. Get him, dog meat. Get his head off. Good job.
Take care of one. Another one. Another one. Another one. Good job, dog meat. I also love the sound that uh, Fistful does. I love the sound. Let's raid some bodies. We did a lot of killing. Shit. Too good with my ears. I'm too good with my ears. I may make a mistake once in a blue moon, but it's not a blue moon yet. Ooh, melons. And gourds. Perfect. Got an idea. That woke their ass up. Yeehaw, Harley. That woke their ass up, didn't it? Thank you for the clip as well, Mr. Rumble Roses. Getting real good with your clips, too. Okay, this one's going to be a little bit of a doozy. They're over here. Got it. Nice. Time for a showcase showdown. Get up. Get up, motherfucker. Open them up for a barbecue, damn right. Down. Dude, the sound of the gun, I love it. I love the sound of this gun. That's not the end of them, though. There's going to be far much more that I'm going to have to deal with. Huh, short laser musket, okay. I know, right? Just listen to this gun, though. That ooh, sound at the end. I love it. I love it. Usually some of them come out of the bathroom. Yeah. It's interesting why they're not coming out. Fusion cell. Interesting. Okay. Maybe I messed up the spawning, maybe. I don't know. More rat teeth. Oh, God. It's not just the umph, man. It's the sound they make when you do the umph. How you doing, sir?
How did that not kill him? Oh, dog meat's on the case. Good job, dog meat. Damn. He's hungry for that death, man. My boy. My boy. Well, for one, greetings to you, Fallout 4 streamer. And two, I don't know. I need to open this up. Well, that didn't work. Okay. Try it from the center this time. Okay. A little bit more to the left. Okay, maybe not. Okay, so that means it's a little more to the right. Perfect. Got it. Hot plate, that'll be useful. Let's see. Bet you that there's more in the back. More ghouls in the back. Well, the sun will do that. It's a really, really hot day, man. It's been it's gonna be a hot summer. It's probably why I haven't been going to many places lately. Won't be able to pick this. No way I can use the turn. Yeah. Yeah, I know you're from the Texas area. It's been like 95 degrees here in the North Carolina area. Drink some of my Coca Cola here. I'll do a couple randoms. That's it. Oh, never mind. It was right there. Okay. Uh, safe control. Disengage lock. Protectron control. Personality mode. I always like the uh, the law enforcement ones, no matter what its original programming is. I just like the um, thing to activate the unit. He'll get rid of some of the ones that uh, that I'll end up missing. Hello. Move along, citizen. I shall. Awesome. That is great to know, man. Hopefully you have been behaving yourself lately. Ooh, more melons. No mind if I do. Give me that melon. Thank you. Sugar bombs. Part of a best balanced breakfast. Burnt fashion magazine. Wonder glue. Never mind. Buff out. Venal. Blend style. Lose empty bottles. Don't do that to me, dog me, I swear. One day I'm gonna accidentally fucking shoot you. Well, I have before. But that's not the point. <laughs> hmm. oh. Oh, let's see what we got here. 
Oh, I think there's some in there too. Yeah, my bars are moving. Yeah, they start coming out in here. Right in here. Told you. Bitch, get down. God, I love the sound of this gun. Makes me all jittery. I'll take the camera. Hmm. Okay. Nothing in the fridge except for a foot. Carrot. Soap. Yeah, soap um, has oil. Open the door. This is the one where it happens. Yep, that's the bathroom. Okay. Get down, boy. -o. A spoon and a box of sugar bombs. Oh boy. I'll take the red dress too. I'll I'll put that on Piper. Let's see though. A kitty picture. Station. The food and fallout are big time unhealthy food. Well, yeah, I mean, we're we're dealing with an apocalypse, man. You know, things are gonna be unhealthy for a long while. I heard something that wasn't dog meat. Unlock the wooden crate. No. Not that way. This way. Really? Okay. Got it. There we go. Yes. That wander glue, though. All right. Wow. Okay. Apparently, the game wants to be like. Oh, I'm going to make you miss the whole entire fucking time. Here, watch. I won't miss now. I'm not going to miss. There you go. Told you I wasn't going to miss. New Cola Quantum has 200 more calories than normal New Cola. And three times more sugar. Yeah, I know. And you know what I do when it comes to that? You, you, you know what I do when it comes to that, though? See this, uh, see all these, uh, nukes I got here, you know, num, 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 you know, you, you know what I think about, uh, 200% more calories in nuka cola, three times more sugar quantum, that's what I think about it, it's my favorite nuka. Oh, 
Oh yeah, I know, and I'm one of them. Let's see. Glow sided calibrated. No. Pocketed leather. Okay, I can take all that off of there. Let's see. My eye is bothering me again. Yep, I know. Is that rat poison? Yeah, it's rat poison. Okay. Yes, I do. Let's see. Got anything nice in here? Is this where I was before? This is where I was before. Alright, let's see. <laughs> Thought so. I've been going through some depression lately. I'm kind of not in the mood for singing at the moment. But when I do, I'll sing it more. Plus, remember, you got Mr. Snake Man from me, you know. No, it's okay. I've just been having a lot of stuff going on lately, and my depression's been kicking in. I'm not trying to sound grumpy or anything. Commonwealth. Open. Okay. I mean, I did get everything out of there, so I may as well leave. The question is, what else is here? I'll have my vats activated just in case. Waiting on the load. Yeah, I've killed a behemoth at low level before. Take the musket, why not? I'll open the door. Then why don't you go rest, man? Let's see. 153 out of 260. I say... And no, the sunlight driving is not fully cleared out. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Miss Mandolin, also known as Mama Manda, she's been a busy, busy woman. Oh, yeah. Also, she's been streaming, too. She's been streaming some good stuff lately. It's either been uh, Detroit. I think it's uh, 
the trip become human or uh fallout shelter yeah amanda she finally got her emotes um approved as well i'm very very proud of her i knew for a fact that when i uh when i made affiliate i knew for a fact that i had to bring her with me i met her on vidme and I don't regret ever meeting that woman. That's a person that deserves some followers too, is her. Because she's been busting her ass too. She's been having her jobs and stuff combined with other situations going on. Oh, wow. Okay. Reload. Transfer. Store all junk. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. All right. Hey Sheffield. What's going on, boy? Oh, we're gonna we're gonna make you some resources here. Yeah. Make a pretty fucking garden, man. Yeah. Garden. Yeah. Yeah. A, A, A. Give me some gourd. A. Got all these melons. Got all those melons. Yeah. Now let's see. Put some melons right there. Put some melons right there. We'll plant a few things of melons as sanctuary. <laughs> Let's see. Got some moot fruit. We'll put the moot fruit right there. Don't have any Taito, I don't think. Oh, there's a pallet I can get rid of, though. That reminds me, I should get rid of some of this stuff here. So many boobies. What do you mean, boobies? I don't understand. What, what What's making you see boobies? Wherever you see boobies, I want some. I'm a single man. I need some boobies in my life. <laughs> I'm fucking stupid. Um, okay, can I make any turrets, though? I need some defenses. I can make two. Let's see. We'll put one there. And we'll put one there. Okay, I need to get more gears. So R1 tech for search. Yes. Twas a joke because you were saying so many melons. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hell, yeah, homie. Hell, yeah. All right, let's see. Let us jump down here. Pull out our gun. We're going to go straight to Sanctuary. And we're not going to do stuff for Preston Garvey. Because Preston Garvey gets on our nerves. My dad says I'm too young to watch a rated R movie. And by law, I can watch without parents. To each their own. I remember um, the first rated R movie I ever watched, and I don't regret it one bit. Oh, wow. Um, it was The Terminator. They were having a re-showing at a theater that was close to me, and uh, I snuck in so I could watch The Terminator. First rated R movie. Best rated R movie. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Excuse me, Sturgis. Let's see what we got here. What have we got? We got some gears. Alright. Cool. Alright. Let's see. Steel. I've got balls of steel. Alright. Let's see. Yeah, we'll plant some melons here for them. Why not? Seems to be growing well. 
take some stuff for myself, of course. First rated R movie was a porn movie when I was between 11 and 13. Ah, I stopped watching porn many, 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 many years ago. Just doesn't do it for me, you know. Um, I do like the Terminator movie. Oh, God, yeah, the first Terminator movie is always my favorite. I absolutely love it, man. Uh, I'll keep the gourds. But I'll plant some melons for these guys. <laughs> Alright. Let's see. Yeah, we'll do that. But, you know, I'm 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 gonna keep the gourds for myself. It's only fair. It's only fair I have something to take home with me. Alright. But yeah, hold on, hold on, hold on. Just, just listen real quick. I love the sound of this gun. It's the only pipe-type weapon that I actually like. Because it's a revolver. I like it. I like revolvers. Uh, How to Train Your Dragon. It was, a, it was an okay movie. Wasn't my kind of cup of tea, though. Um, uh, Despicable Me, it was okay. I like the Minion movies more, though. Oh, oh my god, those sounds. I fucking love it. Which sounds are you talking about, Rumble? I'm making many sounds right now. <laughs> Man, my fucking eyes are killing me today. Oh my god. Mm. Hold on. There we go, that's better. Alright, I want to see if I can... Can I build more turrets? Let's find out. Yes, I can build two more. Good. Oh, the random ones, yeah. Well, that's awesome, dude. That is very awesome indeed. I used to know all the lines to the Terminator movies until I got old. I need more gears and more oil. Let us go and see Trudy. Excuse me. Shit. <laughs> oh, hello. <laughs> what a party. I must be the party pooper. Seems so. Yeah. Nice and bloody. Yeah. There we go. I wanted to put hey my there. gun away. I can rest easy knowing that Wolfgang is rotten and... I've got a few minutes to browse. All salvage, but nothing's done. Ha, <laughs> finally got that steam elements random thing to up here. Awesome. All right, let's see. So this stuff here. Don't need it. I do want to keep the grenades and cocktails because those can replicate dynamite. 
for my character. Let's see. Salt gas mask. Actually, no, no. I can't put on leather stuff with this character. I'll keep the red dress just for Piper, though. Better been. All right. Crispy square bits. No, I don't need that. Sell the jet. Excuse me. Oh man, that was crazy. Mm. Now let's see what type of stuff you got, Trudy. Got anything useful for me? Joints are hurting now. Why did you troll a Fallout 4 streamer? I don't like trolling. Why did you do that for? You got your aid. Don't be so mean to people. Trolling's mean. Don't troll people. Even still, trolling is not a really good thing to do. I don't troll people. It's probably why I'm a very boring guy. That's good enough. Well, as long as you don't come here telling me what to do, that's perfectly fine with me. I know enough. Which is why I already pre-ordered Fallout 76. And I'm going to be attempting the beta. With my boys Bink and Hobbit. And that's going to be fun. We're going to be some of the first people to walk the wasteland. And I am excited. Let's see if we can do this here. Let's build some more turrets. Stop trolling people. Not a fun thing to do. One, two, three, one, two, three. All right, now I'll put some back here, too. Mm. 
tie for search. Also get some more gears and circuitry as well. Probably the best bet will be going to Diamond City for that. Alright, hold on. Rumble. It won't let me tag a lot of the stuff, so uh remind remind me in the chat to get some circuitry, some gears, and some oil. I bet the Fallout 76 stuff can make some memorable clips. Oh yeah. That's why I can't wait for you to be uh um with me in that on um in November. That's gonna be fun. Alright, let's go to Diamond City. <clears throat> Actually, I'm very close to going up another level, which is what I've been wanting. <sighs> Circuitry, gears, oil. All right, got you. Welcome to Diamond City. Oh, not this again. Don't move, Sim. What have you done with the real Riley? Where's my brother? I swear I'm not. I want to try something. Not a Sim. Don't I shoot. Try For something. God's sakes, we're family. Put the gun down now. He's a Sith. He'll kill us all. Kyle, no. Okay, show's over. There are no synths in Diamond City. Hear me? Just you folks and your damn paranoia. Move along. In 76, I'm already in a group for Fallout 76. Plus, aside from being in a group in Fallout 76, I'll also see if I can do some single player online as well. You all need that. Myrna. The synth is dead, right? That's what happened? Seems so. Nah, nah, I'm not really interested. All right, Myrna and Percy. Everyone else may be closed, but Diamond City. I'll take a look. Sure. Anything and everything. Let's see what you got, Percy. Okay. So. Let me see here. Okay, if you see me in your lobby, Fallout 76, and it's been out for a while, and I'm staying, still come to me, I'll be like, high level trader in the... Okay. Don't need fusion cells. Let's see.
I'll end up getting more 38 rounds anyways. I'll be able to get more. Confirm the trade. That's good enough. All right, let's go back. All right. Go back there, make some more turrets. And I'll do something that has to do with the quest line. storm well that's not good that's not good at all all right yeah we can make four and I can level up That's good. I like that. So I got tons of them in the front. Got some in the back. But don't get yourself ahead of yourself now. I may know a lot about what's going on in 76. Same with Bink and Hobbit. But we still don't know everything. Don't get your don't get your hopes up yet. Rats tag. More rat chunks. Smoking steak. Ribeye steak. Don't get cocky. Let's go ahead and level up. Okay. So now I should be able to put up that. Yes. Gunslinger. I'm a level set. Okay, it's for 15. Okay, so I'd have to get to 15 in order to make it up to star 3. Perfect. Okay. Alright, now let's go back to Diamond City. Got our defenses up and everything. I believe I have to talk to Piper. I believe. Don't quote me yet. See something. Oh, uh, yeah. Let's go talk to Pipe. Piper. Hello, Where's April O'Neil. You holding up, Blue? Sarcastic. My favorite ballpark's become a shanty town. So, today's been great. Interesting you mentioning that, seeing as you're from a vault. Yeah, you're not wearing the blue jumpsuit right now, but the Pip Boy and that fish out of water look? Dead giveaways. 
So here's the deal. I want an interview. Your life story in print. I think it's time Diamond City had a little outside perspective on the Commonwealth. You do that, and uh, I'll tell you what. I'll come with you. Watch your back while you get used to the world above ground. Sarcastic. Here's your headline. Local man says no. Gonna be like that, huh? Smart ass. Fine. We'll do this later, but I want that interview, got me? Piper. You ready for that interview now, Blue? Yeah, we'll do it. I just wanted to do that. All right, Piper. I'm in. Good. I just wanted to do that. I'm sorry. Get down to business. So, I know you're from a vault. How would you describe your time on the inside? Well, sarcastic. It was just me and a thousand guinea pigs. They turn carnivorous. Okay. Carnivorous. I guess we're going to have to go with the satirical approach. <laughs> So you've seen the common Diamond City. How does it compare to Oh man. Mm. Gives me hope. Honestly, seeing everyone surviving out here, rebuilding the world, it gives me hope. That's surprisingly inspired, Blue. We're definitely quoting that. Now I already know you're looking for your son, Sean. Do you suspect the Institute was involved in his kidnapping? I don't know. I don't know. No one ever does. That's what makes them so scary. For the last part of our... The Boogeyman! I want you to make a statement to Diamond City direct. The threat of kidnapping is all but ignored in the Commonwealth. Oh, I bet. What would you say to someone out there who's lost a loved one but might be too scared or too numb to the world to look for them? Mm. Don't lose hope. I'll, I'll be nice with that one. you want to give up, don't. You have to have hope that you'll see them again. Or at least that you'll know the truth. A strong note to end on, Blue. Thanks. That's everything. It's going to take some time to put this all together, but I think your story is going to be done. Sure, why not? Look, about your son. I didn't know if you were on the up and up before. Didn't want to waste my friend's time, but I think he can help you. His name's Nick Valentine, a detective extraordinaire. Got an office here in Diamond City. Just look for the neon sign with the heart in it. Sarcastic. Neon sign with a heart? You sure he's not running a brothel? <laughs> <laughs> that would be hilarious, but no. No, Blue, he's on the up and up. Anyway, I agreed to come with you, right? Watch your back. Just say the word when you're ready. I can't wait to see where the story goes next. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Probably. I wouldn't say no, you know. That's a nice you nuka chair. Order could consider themselves a success until someone threatened their life. Me? I'm very successful. You're still a young boy. I'm not sure. That's something you should be thinking about right now, sir. I'm Bobby Pin Box. I'll take the stem packs and purified water. Take that. Mmm, rumble. Mmm. Alright. We'll start the storyline for Nick. But we're not going to do it yet. You get pretty chummy with that reporter, huh? Be careful.
I believe you, Rumble. I believe you, homie. Newcomer, huh? Talk to Abbott at the wall. Sometimes you gotta wonder. Does anyone fight back? Institute has to have enemies. What? You mean the rip? <laughs> Told you your luck wouldn't last forever. His ties. Oh, Nick. Something wrong? Another stray coming in from the rain. Rage you're too late. Office is closed. Sorry. I'll come back later. No, that's not what I mean. We're not just closed for the day. We're closed permanently. The detective's gone missing. I'll do some sarcasm. Picture on milk carton time? If only it was that simple, right? <laughs> Nick disappeared working a case. Skinny Malone's gang had kidnapped a young woman and Skinny Malone. Them down to their hideout in Park Street Station. There's an old vault down there they use as a base. I told Nick he was walking into a trap, but he just smiled and walked out the door like he always does. Hmm. I'll offer help. I'll find him. You have my word. Thank you. Nick should be easy to spot. He's always wearing that old hat and trench coat get up. Please hurry. Alright, well. Level up once again. Alright, well, we're gonna level up today. Hmm. Another settlement needs your help. I'll mark it on your map. Help them, General. Um, let's see. That takes level 18 to do that. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I've heard a lot of them. do that. <sighs> the Mysterious Stranger. One of my favorite parts of all the Fallout games.
Okay, so really going to bed. <laughs> Hobbit. <laughs> Get yourself to bed before Miss Dana whoops your ass in the morning. You're absolutely hilarious, Hobbs. Good night, homie. I'll talk to you later, man. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man, Hobbs. Oh, man. You crack me up, Hobbs. No, I'm not next. I'm not next. I'm not next. But um, Bet Rumble didn't even know that Hobbit was still there. Self-prescribed Kim, as recommended by me, myself, and I. I know that already. Nice piece you got there. Right, let's see. Combat zone. That would be one hell of a thing to deal with right there. Hmm. Yeah, I know. Hobbs hilarious, man. Now, let us go back to Red Rock. Oh man, I had a shiver there. Oh my god. That felt weird. I don't know what happened there. I was randomly looking and I saw you message me in chat on Twitch. Did I? That must be one old fucking message. I haven't messaged you on Twitch in a long time. Oh, that one. Yeah, I was watching, um, I was watching Miss Sangri and, uh, watching somebody else and you were in the same streams as I was. Now I remember. Yeah. Thank you. It's like I can finally think straight. Yeah, it's called multi-twitch. I do a lot of that, actually. I do a lot of multi-twitch stuff. Multi-twitch is actually an app, though. Where uh, you can watch more than one stream at the same time. It's a phone app. Very useful app, too. I mean, you need to get out of the fucking way. Alright. Well, there is one place I can, though. Okay, seriously, though. Good night. I'll see if I can do more Assassin's Creed tomorrow night. I can't wait. I can't wait either, man. I cannot wait for more Assassin's Creed Origins, man. 
Yeah, everybody, if you haven't already, go uh, go give um, Prideful Entertainment's Iron Hobbit a follow, man. Which I, I'm trying to help him get to 100 followers, and he's actually very, very close. So if you haven't already, go ahead and follow that amazing, awesome guy. While I check this place out and kill me some mole rats. I want to try something funny. <laughs> you didn't like that, did you? Hey, man, you deserve a whole lot more than that shout out, homie. <laughs> I burned them all alive. That was funny. One's missing now. Yes, yeah, spam that. Spam that emote, homie. You spam that shit. Right, let's see. No. And I rocked that shit, though. Move through. All right. Hey, dog meat. Hey. Yo. Psst. Grab that. Get that fusion core. Drop it. Good boy. Good boy. Okay. I want you to go check some stuff How out. How you for doing, me. buddy? Eh. Okay. Uh, fetch. Hey, boy. Think you can find something for me? Find some. Uh, you gonna find some items? See if there's any good stuff nearby, boy. And bring it for me. What you got? Oh, you found a stim pack. Good boy. Very good boy. And you found some black rim glasses too. Hey. That was really good, mud boy. How you doing, buddy? Okay, I want you. Hey boy. Fetch some more items. Find something for me? for me. See if there's any good stuff nearby, boy. Go clear it out so I don't take any bad radiation damage. Go get it, boy. Ah, oh, you found a rifle. You found a pistol. Yeah, you found a good pistol right there. Yeah, I can sell that for some good stuff. We'll get some brain fungus, too. Why not? I think that's the entrance way. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Double back. Uh, bullet action sniper. Okay. I don't need that. Ah, uh, the rad damage. Why did I even bother going that way? Okay, let me cure that then. That was an accident. Right away. Purify water. Oh, uh, by the way, thank you for the clip, Mr. Rumble Roses. You are a gentleman and a scholar, sir. Alright, so we got everything we needed out of here. Let's get the fuck out of Dodge. Oh. Well. Thank you. Didn't know there was one behind me. 
I liked how I threw that damn Molotov and they all burned to fucking hell. I love that. Okay. But yeah, I think I'm actually just going to end it right here, though. So, I'm going to go ahead and uh, do my outro real quick. I'm going to pause the game and stuff, too. So, if you enjoyed what you saw today on Twitch and you want to give the channel some support, you know, give the channel a follow. Um, starting this week, technically... Um, I'm not sure if anybody has seen it on Twitter, but I've decided to make a much more complex type of schedule for my Twitch. Um, hours are still the same, things of that nature, but I've decided that on Mondays and Thursdays, I'll be playing a random game of my choice. Um, but Tuesdays and Fridays are a specific type of game or game series. So on Tuesdays, it'll be Fallout Tuesdays, where I'll either play Fallout 4, might play some Fallout Shelter, hell, it might even be Fallout 76 when that comes out in November. So be on the lookout for that. On Fridays will be Soulsborne Fridays, where either I'll play me some Bloodborne, or I'll play a Dark Souls game of my choice. But aside from that, you know, Mondays and Thursdays are a game of my choice. I guess you could say they're kind of like surprise days. Where I can keep my viewers on their toes about what I'll play. You never know. I might want to play a Fallout game. I might want to get back into, um, uh, what is it? Uh, I might play some Wolfenstein one day. You never know. You never know what I'll play. But I got something very special planned for Thursday. Something in particular that Mr. Rumble Roses may like. Now I will say though that it'll either be next week or the week after. I will be doing a playthrough of Duke Nukem 3D World Tour. Uh, I believe it's episode 5. Which is the episode I haven't done yet. Um, there, which is going to be one of the only times where Mr. Rumble Roses will be allowed to give me orders during a game. Also known as he'll be allowed to backseat. So, yeah, that'll probably be happening either next week or the week after next week. Um, but Thursday, I got something special planned for you guys. So be on the lookout for that. Um, but that's that's it for the main schedule. I do have a couple collaborations this week. Um, I'd say later on today, I think it's going to be between 8 p.m. and 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'll be doing some Dark Souls Remastered with the Bink Live. Uh, pay attention to my Twitter and his Twitter on when that's going to happen. Also, Wednesday, I won't be streaming, but I will be in a stream with the Bink Live on tw on uh, Twitch. And it will be basically him playing some Fallout Shelter while we do some Fallout Talk. And the, and the topic for Fallout Talk will be vault Tech. And I will tell you, your boy loves vaults. That's all I'll say about that. But... If you're watching this later on YouTube, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Uh, give the video a like. Give a nice positive comment down below. Because your boy, he tries to enforce that positivity. Because the whole world is filled with negative assholes that just want to ruin your day. Also, by the way, I forgot to say this in my outro. If you want to give more support than just following the channel... And you have some money lying around or something like that. You can give the channel a subscription on Twitch. Um, there's three different tiers. You can do either a tier 1, which is $4.99. You could do a tier 2, which is $9.99. Or you could do a tier 3, which is $24.99. Also, if you have Amazon, you're also eligible for what is called Twitch Prime. And 
well, you can, you know, drop that free sub on me. You know, it'll help support the channel. And all money from donations and from subscriptions to the channel will go toward me being able to possibly get myself a better computer or even better equipment so I can increase my quality of streaming for everybody watching while still staying in my own formula, of course, you know. But, as always, everyone, thank you so much for watching. I'm your friendly neighborhood game machine, and this was Fallout 4, The Adventures of Isaac Eastwood. And until I see everyone in the next video or live stream, peace out, and happy gaming, my friends.